While I was at my local Lowe's shopping for a new carpet for my bedroom, I came across these boxes called Floragami Peel and Stick Carpet Tile. What caught my eye was this right here. It says, easy to install, easy to clean, oh so easy to love. So I wanted to learn more about it. I went online while in the store and watched some video reviews and saw that it really was easy to install and decided I would get eight boxes to do my bedroom with. And this is what it says on the box. It's Foragami Peel and Stick Carpet Tile. Pop it on top of any hard surface flooring. Peel, stick, love, repeat. Pets and kids are no match. It's permanent until you decide it isn't. Mix colors and craft unique patterns and easy to clean or replace. And all these statements are very true about it. At my local Lowe's, they only had two different colors to choose from. But if you go to the Floragami website, which is just Floragami.com, you can choose from multiple different colors. The color I chose was the tritone beige color. And there's 12 pieces of carpet in here. They call them planks. You can see they're 9 inches wide and 36 inches long. And this was like... I think $78 per box and same things it said on the front okay. when you open it up you'll find the 12 pieces of carpet they've included four of the extra stickers this is how it sticks to the floor and it's real easy to install and it's just the stuff you'll need which you know you just tear the old carpet up if you have carpet that's you know you tear it up and you clean the floor and you just peel and stick these down that's what it's telling you on the back. They start, they say start in the center. I did not start in the center because I, all my carpet, I just got this one color right here. But I've seen people, they've mixed colors and stuff, so they start in the center. I didn't need to start in the center because it's just all one color. And once it's placed together, it looks like one sheet of carpet. You can't see edge lines or anything. Also... I have a lot of stuff in my room and didn't feel like taking it all out so I put everything on one side and then I started the carpet and I'm about to finish it but I wanted to show everybody this carpet and here's how it comes packaged like I said there's 12 we just put them back to back like this and it's real simple to use there's it's the non-skid like a felt type backing on it and then the center is the sticky part right here and it's not very sticky like if you stick it down that it won't be able to come up because I've taken pieces off the part that I did I didn't like it like I needed to move it back up against the wall so I was able to peel it off and then re-stick it so that's a really nice thing and so this is the carpet I currently have. It's like this blue carpet, ugly, old, stained. Over here, I already started putting down the floorigami. So underneath my carpet, I just have the carpet, the padding, and it's like a linoleum. I'm not really sure why that's what they had down, but... It's a bedroom, and that's just what they had down. It's an upstairs bedroom, maybe. That's just what they did. My house is 100 years old, so I don't know why I was expecting to find wood or something under here. But this is nice, too, because the carpet, like, I can lift it up, and it sticks easy, and I can restick it. If I want to change colors, I can change colors. I'm going to pick this carpet up and... 
get the floor ready then I'll show you how to install it I just moved my bed over like that because I didn't want to take the bed out it's a lot of work so I'll be back in a few minutes all right I got the old carpet all tore out the floor underneath cleaned and I got some more of the carpet tiles put down and I would like to show you just how simple it is to install it so this is a carpet you just flip it over and I pick all these little pieces off get it all clean before I set it down okay each one has little arrows when you're installing it it's important to make sure all the arrows are pointing the same way so I have them all pointing towards the one wall and then you just peel this clear plastic strip off and underneath in the center of it is the glue so that's what holds it in place each box comes with four little extra sticky glues and that's for if you need to you're doing a corner or you, you just need a small piece and you cut it and it happens to be on the end right over here where there isn't the glue and if you need more of these you can order them on the Floragami website another thing they have on their website is if you would if you're not don't want to carpet a whole room you just want to make an area rug you can do that and they sell an edge that goes around here to make it look like a area rug so I thought that was pretty neat too but anyways so here's how like you just pick that strip off make sure the arrows are pointing the right way and you flip it over and you just put it in place it's hard to do with one hand like see right there it's not lined up and it's on the floor but that's okay this is how simple it is you can just peel it off and that's a really nice thing about this carpet is if you get tired of it you want to change colors that's how simple it is you just lift it up and peel it off and that's sticky it holds it in place but it's not too sticky it won't ruin the floor underneath so this is good if you have children or pets say they spill something have an accident on the floor and you just need to replace one piece you just peel that piece off and replace it with another piece so it's good to buy an extra box so you have some extra pieces on hand in case you do need to replace one or you can even just pick it up and take it to the sink I've seen people do that just pick one piece out kids build something on it you take it to the sink scrub it up let it dry and then replace it back down so instead of having to get out the carpet scrubber and all that it's easier you just pick it up and go wash it so this is what it looks like what I've done so far I need to fix this part over here all right there it goes yeah so after I put it down I like to just rub it back and forth so you can't really see where the lines are then I also vacuum I'm gonna vacuum before I put everything back in because there's little loose strands and just want it nice and clean but I would like to show you guys that it's on there really good and even if you vacuum it's not going to come up and out of place so I'm gonna vacuum so you can see So there's a Floragami. I think it's really nice. It's really easy to install and I like the carpet. It's not as thick and cushiony as my old carpet because the old carpet had padding underneath but 
I like it and it is soft. Yeah, it's soft and I know a lot of people these days prefer the hardwood floor, but I like something soft under my feet, so I like it and you can't really tell. Like I don't see the lines. It just looks like one someone came in and laid carpet down. You can't see that it's tiles, so I'm really pleased with it. I'm going to get off here and finish my room and put everything back in.